What's up guys? Today reviewing the most one of the most important pieces of equipment bands. Bands for arm wrestling and the, the basic way that I incorporate them. Alright, so standard standard bands. You got all the way from your your light light bands, medium, you know, heavy to extra heavy bands. And you got your, your handles, you got your door stop that you can use. Bands for me is something, uh, it's different than weights, it's more based off of feel, which is really important in a program. Sometimes weights can kind of force you into a set intensity, and for things like rehab, you, you don't often want that. For rehab, you just, you want to feel your way through the movements, feel your way through the exercise, and I find that bands, just uh, the way they work with the variable tension, um, it's just way easier to have like a more rehabilitative workout. So typically the way I use bands is um, four ways. Okay, what I'll do is I will step on the band, okay, and I will wrap my wrist, bring the far one close, and the, the, the near one over my knuckle. And in this way, I will work my rise, okay? And I'll do between 30, 30 and 50 repetitions typically. And I can go fast, or I can just really feel the movement. My next exercise will be pronation over the thumb, and I'll twist, and when I twist, I'll pay special attention to the movement of the thumb as I pronate. I'll drive up, I will twist my thumb. Sometimes I'll extend my arm more open like so to isolate the pronation. From here, I will use either a door stop or a bar. I'm going to use a door stop and this one I will work more the supination chain. Something like this when I'm going to twist in, work my supination piece, work my tricep, work my press. This motion is Really nice balance for all inside portions of the arm wrestling game. And for the last movement that I typically do is I will work grip. I'll work my grip. And I'll basically just open and close my hand very simply. So what I'll do is these four exercises kind of one after the other. And then I will just add difficulty, add difficulty, add difficulty until I'm stacking bands together. And when things start to feel uncomfortable or I'm breaking form, then the workout's done. Uh, in my opinion, it's like super valuable. Uh, I, I, I use bands every day uh, throughout most of my training cycles. I will use them especially more towards the end as the competition gets close, just uh, so I put things more in the in the hands of a feeling and uh, less less constrained by the amount of weight I'm actually doing. Anyways, hope this helps. Uh, brought to you by Stay Master, everybody.